Hey, it's Amy and Tim from Go With Less, and it's our last full day in Berlin. So the question begins, did we go on that bike tour? And Are then what happens if we did or didn't go on the bike tour? <laughs> and then we're gonna head back to our place and take it easy. And then we're gonna meet our Denver friends for pizza for dinner. A friend in Denver, a different friend who's not here with us, uh, suggested this place. Uh, we trust her and her pizza knowledge. Yeah, and she so said some of the best pizza she's ever had. And so we have our couple friends, uh, Howard and Christy, and another friend from Boulder, Colorado, Adam, has just come to town last night. And a stopover so hopefully the five of us are going to go have some pizza tonight so to stay that. tuned because we'll show it all and then in a second you'll know if we did our bike tour okay so did we do the bike tour we did <laughs> we did we're so cheap we can't help it but we had a modification that's right so we started out the morning and it was raining when we got there at 10 a.m it was rain it was yeah. pouring it was serious raining and it was really cold so as a matter of fact our our phones said the temperature felt like it was was it 49 degrees is what it, it said chilly. it felt like 49 degrees fahrenheit on a bike in the rain we don't have any rain gear would have been like so oh. our tour was with an outfit called fat fat tire, fat tire. And so they were very accommodating and they let us go on a tour a little later. So we went on a tour, tour at 11. And so our friends who were going to go on the tour with us, they said, okay, we'll wait till 11, see what the weather's going to look like. And we, we decided to go. They decided not to we go. We don't on the blame tour. them because there were moments during this tour. So right now it's, it's lovely and, and it actually is still kind of chilly. I have all my clothes on. Um, but, uh, <laughs> but there were moments with we got our ponchos out. So we've been traveling around with these it was like, folded rain ponchos. And we've been traveling with those for almost three weeks now, every single day, just in case, because there's quite a bit of rain here. We haven't busted those out yet because they're kind of like single use. They are huge. They get very small and then they're huge and you're not going to pack them up in your luggage again. So um, so we were waiting to use them. Well, we used them on our bike ride. We couldn't use on our umbrellas. Yep. And it was a, it was oh, raining. We're glad, we're glad we went on the cold. tour. Yeah. So right now we're at a and beer we're garden. We just tour. had some lunch here. And so that was very nice. And so lunch wasn't included. We actually had to buy our own lunch. But it we have good. like an hour stop here. It was good. So it's at the beer garden that's in the tier garden. And I'm sure I'm pronouncing both of those things. <laughs> Beer, I may be pronouncing right, but I don't know if I'm pronouncing it. It could be beer. It's gar Gardin or something. We have anyway. no idea. I don't We're know. wrong. I apologize to all Germans for my poor pronunciation. We are, yes. Yeah, so we, we understand that, yeah. So if we are, if they have like a chip to implant all languages into people, we're the first <laughs> we're ones to up. sign up for this there language chip. But anyway, so what was cool about this, we did on our first full day a free walking tour and we walked past a lot of these things, but there, now we're filling in places that we hadn't yep. been. And on a bike, you can cover some serious. That's distance. exactly right. So that's been really nice. Like we're riding, I mean, several miles today that would have been like more miles than it would have been okay to walk. Yeah, so there was a premium to do the bike versus the walks. We love to do these free walking tours that sort of introduce us to a city. So there was a premium. We paid about 70 bucks for both of us to be on this tour. So that's a serious premium over free. However, we get to see a whole lot more in, a, in this condensed amount of time. So even though we're on this for uh, what three hours? Four and a four, half. Four and a half hours. That includes so, our lunch. So uh, we, we get to cover a, a serious amount of ground because we're on a bike, whereas yeah. when you're walking, not so much. So. And here's the thing: is that we were able to take that money and put it into uh, their sister company in Munich into a Munich tour. Oh. The problem is, is that Munich doesn't have any bikes, what? so we could have upgraded to a more expensive e-bike tour, which would have been. Amy was saying that the or tour company is very accommodating. Very accommodating. So they Fat were willing bikes. to let us do this. If it, if we were going to call it a rain day and just say, nope, we're not going to do this. So that we could have canceled by like 8 a.m. yet a full day in advance, yeah. which is very reasonable for a full refund. We probably should have done that. Um, we should have done that. Because but. they have a presence here as well as in Munich, which is where we're to next, they said that they would also let us do something in Munich. But and uh, we're, we're really happy dying to, to do a Segway tour. Have you ever done yeah. it? We've done a Segway tour once. We loved it so much that every time Tim sees a Segway, which is every 10 minutes it. here, he says, I want to. Segway. It's very expensive. Though. Yeah, they're expensive. But have you done one? And if you have, are you the only person on earth who hasn't said, I got to have one of these when you get home? We don't get one, but we want one. And so as much as we tease them and they look goofy, we get it. But then when you do it, you're like, this is the best thing ever. And so <laughs> let me know. Did you Have you ever been on a Segway? And if so, did you want to buy one when you got home? Unfortunately, we are doing all these, uh, we're seeing Segways all over the place. The only way we see Segways available is on a guided tour, which makes it kind of expensive. Yep. So you can't just get your own segue for like an hour which would be cool you can't do that so anyway so here we are in the middle of our, our beer garden lunch we had a great schnitzel and a cheese plate on um, a couple pictures of that and a beer. But, uh, yeah of course he had a beer and so uh, so we're happy to see that the the day is turning around and we hope that it stays that way because we still have some of our tour to do yep thanks for watching
So when, since reunification, Berlin has been under construction, at least that's our understanding. And so you'll see some of this here. And it continues to be under construction today. And then over here on the big cathedral. So our bike tour is done. It was supposed to be four and a half hours. It was almost five and a half hours. So that was a, a really good tour in the end. The weather turned out great, so we're happy that we went. Uh, on our way home, we, pa we passed a hotel that was kind of on my radar for this cool fish tank. It's at the Radisson Blue Hotel a in a Berlin. It's a, but I'm gonna show you, Tim's gonna show you in a second. But uh, we thought we could go get real close to these fish. It turns out you need to have like a separate entry admission to the aquarium, and this is part of the official next door aquarium activity. Uh, so we're just gonna take a quick little video in the lobby of the Radisson Blue. This thing is five to six, six stories tall. And there's an elevator that runs through the middle of the fish tank. Well, there you have it. There's our last full day in Berlin. We had an amazing bike ride and we had pizza with our friends for dinner, so it was a great day. Yeah, and one thing I realized, because I take care of all the money, I do a spreadsheet in the room every single night and update every penny we spent and everything that we did. So what I realized, and maybe you realize this too, is our frugal trip isn't really so frugal. So we're doing all kinds of stuff. We went to a show, we went to out to dinner, like many, 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 many times. Our bike ride was kind of expensive. We paid for our art tour, uh, our street art tour. So this is not really in the vein of our frugal tour. That's right. so, so now we're on a mission to a lower mission. our average. Yeah, so we're gonna be lowering our average. So starting today, so starting tomorrow, when we head to Munich, we are hopefully going to be embracing frugality. So Again. if you're like, what the heck? This isn't so, this frugal couple isn't so frugal. We get it, we agree with you. We're gonna take it totally to a new level starting in Munich, hopefully for the rest of the trip. We'll have a couple splurges, but they're not gonna be throughout the day every day. So stay tuned. Thanks.